Purdue MEN's assistance, I was able to do three co-ops. Uh, the first one was from Jan to May uh, with Tesla in the payments team. Uh, the second one was with Ernst & Young uh, in the business consulting unit. And the third one was with Amazon Robotics uh, in Boston, Massachusetts that lasted from August to December. So I ended up doing three dream roles with three dream companies. I picked Purdue MEM because it was such a flexible program. I'm really focused on engineering design myself and being able to construct my own path through MEM has allowed me to pick classes that I think are important to my future um, while also building that business experience outside of engineering. I joined Purdue MEM with a certain set of goals. <laughs> I definitely wanted to take advantage of the co-op aspect of Purdue MEM. Uh, I knew from the beginning that I wanted a one year long co-op. I also knew that I wanted to diversify my set of experiences and gain as much skills, both technical and soft skills, as much as possible. So I had my co-op with Amazon Robotics, uh, mainly in supply chain logistics under project management. And my project was mainly in transportation optimization. I joined the company in a very critical time when um, the company was going through transformation, the organization was growing. I saw potential of moving through different roles within the company. Um, as an international student in early careers, I think I really wanted to explore and get a flavor of what exists out there. I always knew my calling was towards technology and product, but in the US, uh, the terms are really uh, close, yet so different. I'm a strong believer that accepting your strengths and weaknesses actually lets you deliver, and I wanted to know what I'm best at and then choose it. Because a lot of times this has happened uh, with a lot of mentors and friends and seniors. We've gotten three, four years into our careers only to realize this is not the calling. So I thought of utilizing the opportunity that Purdue MEM gives you and instead pursue three roles and then get to pick what you're best at and then create that impact. I think MEM prepared me very well to be in a startup environment like Form Labs because it's uh, focused more on the ability to adapt to the situation um, and take on roles outside of what your job description may be. I think that's the biggest strength of MEM in that it prepares you to tackle problems from multiple angles, both the technical and the business side, um, and that's very good in an entrepreneurial environment. As part of my co-op experiences, uh, I was fortunate enough to be in two very different cities. <laughs> uh, my first two co-ops were based out of uh, St. Louis, Missouri. Uh, and the last one, Zipline, was based out of South San Francisco, California. <laughs> Two very different cities, very different vibes. And I loved it at both places. MEM is a well-rounded program. It equips you both in, like, with technical skills and um, management and leadership skills. Overall, it's been the greatest decision and I'm, I'm fortunate to uh, have made the decision to come here and to have gotten the acceptance as well to pursue my graduate degree. My experience in MEM has been great because I've got to learn about optimization algorithms, um, making better design decisions, and understanding the business constraints that uh, surround every decision that you make in an engineering context. And so MEM has prepared me well to move on um, beyond my academic career, and I think I'm really ready to move into the workforce. The Masters of Engineering Management program is, is really a marquee program here for Purdue. It's a really competitive market out there. So my job here as the Senior Career Advisor for the program is to uh, provide the guidance to the students. So it's important to be able to stand out. Purdue MEM has allowed me to do all of it. <laughs> and it, it has truly been one of my best experiences.